In this video, I'm going to describe the correct process to install VirtualBox into macOS Monterey without any errors and how to fix this message of error if it appeared after the installation. Kernel drive not installed. Please follow the steps. Download the latest version of VirtualBox from the official website. Then download the, the supporting folders or extensions. Wait until the download completed. Now install VirtualBox. Accept this message. Continue. Write your password. Accept this message. Now let's open the application. And add the extension. References. Extensions. Add. Search for the place where you download the extension in the download folder. Okay. Install. Accept. Write the password. Now we have successfully installed the extension. Now let's try to create a new virtual machine. Mm. For example, Windows XP. Increase the memory size. Create virtual hard disk. Virtual hard disk. Dynamic allocation. Uh, 10 gigabytes, okay. Now load the ISO folder. Choose. And start. You will get this error message. Kernel drive not installed. So we have to fix this error. Close the error message. And close the application. Go to your system references. Security and privacy. You will see this message you have to accept. You have to accept the updates just by pressing allow. You will get a notification message that your MacBook must be restarted. Accept the restart. After the new restart of your MacBook, we can test the application that everything is working OK and the message disappeared. Just open the VirtualBox application and start the virtual machine. Here you can see that the message disappeared and the new Windows is going to be installed. You can complete the installation as you want. Thank you.